Patrick Wilson teases crazy never-before-seen VFX techniques used in the sequel to Aquaman. What's up, everyone? It's TK here, and I'm back with another dose of Collider News. While we still have a little bit to wait before Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom hits theaters, Collider caught up with Patrick Wilson, who plays King Orm in the DC franchise, and he filled us in on some of the amazing VFX advances used in the sequel to James Wan's Aquaman. We've got great relationships in the movie, some fantastic action sequences. We push all the fighting and the stunts. We've used crazy techniques between us and The Flash that have never been used before. Before. Meanwhile, when Collider asked Wilson about the plot of the sequel, let's just say he kept his lips tightly sealed, but did offer this. And the storyline is obviously not going to get into that, but James loves to pick and choose from his own mind and comics and how we bring in certain elements. Those little moments that even, I don't know, pick one in the gladiator sequence, there's an octopus playing drums. Now comic book nerds will go, yeah, well, that's Topo. Come on, guys, that's who it is. So those little moments, there'll be a lot more of that stuff for sure. Well, be sure to catch all of those moments when Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom hits theaters on December 16th. In the meantime, stay locked on Collider.com for all of your movie and TV news, trailers, and reviews.